Hey cosplayers, I'm Skylar Osler, and in today's video I'll be showing you how to make Wonder Woman's skirt from the live action Wonder Woman film using craft foam and a pair of Spanx. Stay tuned! Alright, before we jump into it, I've created a Wonder Woman cosplay guide for you, complete with reference images, costume components, origin, poses, everything you need to know to be able to cosplay Wonder Woman. So the best part is it's completely free. Just go to the link below and get yours. All right, let's get started. We'll begin by creating the patterns for the four sets of panels that hang down on the skirt, front, sides, and back. Then use some painter's tape to trace out the front panel of the skirt. You can choose how long you are comfortable with. Each panel will be made of two pieces, one wider piece and a skinnier piece layered on top of it that runs along the wider bottom layer. Trace them out on the painter's tape and then cut them out. If you want to do what I did, I just used the front panel pattern to create the left and right panels and only drew out the back panel as a separate template. But you can draw them all out separately if you'd like. After you have the four main panel patterns created, you will then want to create one for the side using the same method. Wonder Woman's skirt has these two overlapping leather pieces that run across the hip, overlapping the side panel and slightly overlapping the front and rear panels. Once you have your panel patterns created, it's time to transfer these shapes over to the craft foam. Trace your patterns onto the black 2mm craft foam. It's important to use the black craft foam as it will save you lots of time when it comes to paint. I have the craft foam I use listed in the materials kit linked in the description. Then cut out all your skirt panels out of the foam, making sure to keep the front and back pieces of each panel together with their proper pairs. Next, we need to make this craft foam look like leather to really sell the Wonder Woman Amazonian warrior look. If you want to see how to do that, pause this video and check out my how to make foam look like leather video linked above and below. Then come back here and we'll continue. Alright, welcome back. Now that you have successfully performed the miracle of turning foam into leather, let's take your leatherworking skills to the next level and begin assembling the skirt together. You'll begin by attaching each of the panel pairs together by adding about an inch wide spread of contact cement along the top back side of the longer skinnier piece and a matching spread of contact cement along the top front of the larger underlayer piece. Let the contact cement sit for about 5 to 10 minutes, as per bottle instructions, and then press the two pieces together. Repeat this process for each of the four main panels. Before we move forward, take the rear panel and a razor and slit the rear panel under piece along the lines of the skinnier top layer so that it looks like this. Once all of the four main panels are assembled, we will add them to the space. This is where the breastplate belt reference lines you made earlier will really come in handy. Adding an inch wide spread of the contact cement to the back top of each panel and a corresponding strip along where you want to attach it. Attach the front, sides, and rear panels. Now lastly, add the overlapping side pieces in the same way, with a strip of glue along the top of each and a matching strip of glue where it will go. Then attach it. Make sure to put the lower piece on first and then overlap the upper piece after. Ta-da! You now have the completed structure of the skirt. Now you just need to give it some battle damage and the slight blue sheen that Wonder Woman's skirt has. The way I did that was using some metallic blue automotive paint. Spray some good coats of it on and kind of wipe away parts of it to dull it slightly. I also used some subtle dry brushing with a Rust-Oleum light blue in some spots to add a little more dimension. Voila! You did it! There is no skirting around the fact that this is one very legit Wonder Woman gladiator skirt. Nice work. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching. Seriously, I am so grateful to all of you for your support in watching and learning with me. And uh, just thank you so much. If you like this video, give it a like, share it with your friends. Uh, most importantly, subscribe and select to be notified of all videos so that you can see when I come out with other videos for awesome things like this that I release. So once again, thank you for watching. Like. Subscribe and cosplay on, my friends. Bye bye. Wave. Bye bye. Say bye. Daddy. Wave bye. Can you wave? Say bye. Bye. Bye, everybody. Bye, everybody. Bye. Bye. Can you wave? Say bye. Blow me a kiss. Go. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. <laughs> Keep like. Okay, you ready? Complete with reference images. Dad, I, told uh, I took it off. Good job.
this is Nancy, she's helping us out today for showing off the skirt. Can we see the skirt there? Guys, thanks for watching. I really appreciate it. Do you want to wear this or not? No. No? Okay.